How's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here and in today's video I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get a free secret weapon in Grand Theft Auto 5 story mode So you might already know about this But I have yet to discover this and when I found out it was amazing So we're gonna be talking about to get the location of the minigun So it is located inside of the Fort Zancudo military base and you want to walk towards this little tower here If you go in the same exit I went in it's immediately to the right now You're gonna be met with a little bit of resistance So it will be nice to have maybe some body armor or go in as Michael. I love going in as Michael because he can slow down time when he is shooting, kind of like uh, I'm doing a slow motion effect. So if you get caught in a jam, you can always go into the slow motion effect. Now what you want to do is go up this nice flight of stairs. Now fast forward at this a little bit because as you can see, every time I go around the staircase, I'm checking my corner. I guess you could say that because one time I went up here and a guy was waiting for me to come up around the corner and he actually shot me and I wasted about 10 minutes climbing the stairs and I had to do it all over again. So I fast forwarded. You you can see that guy right there going around the corner now there's gonna be two guys up here I was luckily able to get that guy my aim was just awful and uh, once you kill that guy you shouldn't have any resistance to the right there is an elevator you want to ignore that entrance and you just want to go straight ahead and you'll see the minigun on the ground and kind of this like pseudo office right here now you can find the minigun by going into the little category where the RPG will be typically that's the weapon I have and it will give you 1,000 rounds of minigun ammo. Now, this weapon is actually very expensive in the ammunition store, so this will save you a good bit of money if you are able to survive. That is definitely the hardest part. Now, there's just a little guy up one flight of stairs more in a little control tower, so if you want to go take him out, you can, or you can just simply try to navigate your way down to the bottom floor. I would recommend having an escape plan for this. I, you can see when I just got into the, you know, the military base, I parked my car as close as possible to the door. If you're a little bit more organized, you can actually get out of the military base, lose your stars, and actually be able to keep this minigun, which I do think is something that's really cool. So anyways guys, if you did enjoy this video or found the information helpful, I would encourage you guys to leave a like on the video, push that thumbs up button, and what is your favorite weapon in Grand Theft Auto 5? Leave me a comment down below and let me know, and of course if you are new, I would encourage you guys to subscribe as well for more awesome daily gaming videos like this. Anyways guys, take care, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.